Oh look, there's our little fort. Ain't that neat? I mean, it looks like they made a castle. Despair! Those who approach Mount Bashiko face a multitude of deadly traps. How will the Patapons ever manage to topple the fortified Zigaton stronghold? We'll give it a shot, I guess. Uh, equipment, I got these bows. Part of me kind of wants to just give the bows to these guys just because they'll match. They're fire bows, that's neat. Plus the wind amount quickens attacks and resists flame. Quicker attacks might be good. From bow lads. And you get a lame helmet. No spears. I'm not allowed to have the cool fire spears. I'm gonna assume they were fire spears. Uh, did we we picked up a, like a sword, didn't we? Sleep sword, Zord Z. The sword once belonging to a prince who saved the sleeping damsel in the forest puts foes to sleep. Well, that sounds neat. Probably should equip it to these guys, but actually, that like. Has a higher damage output. Maybe I should give it to one of these guys. It's fine. It probably really doesn't matter. Let me actually save. Let me actually save just in case of things are bad. This is a trap after all. Deploy. I probably should really start grinding for better people. Maybe actually fill out my uh, ranks since I don't have a max quite yet. Adding those extra soldiers might have helped me actually beat the convoy. This is a trap. We have to beat up those rocks. An amazing catapult. We're gonna get assaulted by the catapult, that's gonna be fun. I went way too soon. hammer in that last one? I don't know if I actually have a hammer now. Well, like, right now I have a hammer, but I mean from last time. Ooh. guys are not doing great. Of course, when I talk, that's why this is a bad LP. I 
I was kind of hoping for some health. Oh, we're in the fort. Magically, the fort appears. Turns out they can't hit me when I'm right here. Except when the bow guys decide to go in the back. Nice to keep fever. We lost like all of our soldiers. Also panicked. I think the rocks actually are killing me. I think we made it. We'll be okay. We're good. Is that, like, rock that's falling, actually? I think it's landed on my guy, which might have been why I died a little bit there. I can't imagine there being more than that cluster. I think we can maybe handle this if I just play it smart and fever better. Don't, don't... Mighty Kami, I am sorry about that castle. Oh, are we not supposed to win? Priestess Menon! Goodness, lower your voice. What's the problem this time? A catapult has been discovered, yes? I'm really, really tired of your blubbering. Just let me be. Eek? This weapon could be just what we need to topple castle at Satoma Swamp. Oh, snap! What? What was that conversation? Papaya. Catapult? That must be quite a fearsome indeed. Visit Satoma Swamp to find a weapon for seizing Papaya. the castle. So we were supposed to lose that. I wonder if we... I don't know. I, I feel like we did a pretty good job getting through most of that. And then they just, like, killed us. Way of Hope. Special weapon is needed to topple the Mount Bachiko's Fortress. And so luck would have it. The Zigatons have one. Seal it from them. Um... I might try... I might try hunting a little bit. In particular, I kind of want to try fighting the basic, uh, the Donga. Maybe even Mujadonga. I don't know how I feel about fighting the Tremor, though, the Graboid. But I, I feel like maybe grinding up. At the very least, at this stage, I think what I want is to fill out the ranks to, like, what is it? It's like six per group? Yeah, all of them can have up to six, so I at least want to fill it out. Probably fill it out with a bunch of colorful ones, but I don't know. That's going to cost a lot of ka-ching. It depends on how much I get from hunting. We'll see. So this is a little bit of extra. While I was uh, going to go to grind, I went to one of the newer uh, meat collecting spots. Uh, I would have to look at the exact location. It, it's basically the third hunting spot, but... Uh, I recorded this on PlayStation because I wasn't really set up to record because I didn't expect to have such fruitful endeavors. But, so this is pre-recorded. But, um, you saw there, there was a special bird that had a little bit of, a 
unique coloring. So I went to try to hunt that because I was like, oh, he probably gives me like super meat or something. Uh, I decided to do rain dance because, you know, the birds like to run away. I figured if I get the uh, rain going that maybe I would have some more time to hit the birds. I think it was a pretty uh, smart decision or like a good idea. I still can't figure out how to get the uh, rain dance going well. Mainly the end where it goes like pon pon pat pon pon pon. Because like keeping that beat consistent while also moving my thumb to the square button really kind of screws me up. So like I missed one there. That was actually a decent attempt too. That's a shame. I, I want to try to get them all because I assume that it's going to keep my fever mode active if I do, but who knows. So there's also a little special uh, boar here as well. I actually really don't know if the rain helped because it basically was the same distance. But that uh, boar is actually a giant horned beetle. And he came at me and is attacking me now. Which kind of scared me because I'm like, oh, geez. I don't have my soldiers with me. So if this guy is stronger than I'm, like, able to beat, then that's going to be an issue. Thankfully, he isn't much of an issue. Uh... And the, the main reason, too, I wanted to just go with the pre-recorded here instead of uh, reloading a save and being like, oh, here's actually something that you missed, is that basically what you have to do here is kill the uh, special bird and the beetle. And I, I think the beetle would always have been something I could beat because he comes right at you. The bird is something that I was more... I guess I felt more like I got lucky with the bird... Because, obviously, they run away, and I think I actually only ended up killing him when he was closer to the uh, end of the stage. So, like, again, the beetle's just assaulting me. He's very rude. I think I cut it out because it was when I was trying to figure out how to get the rain dance. I had mentioned before that the, uh, the boars, these ones that are active right now that have, like, the coloring on their back made me think they were beetles. I can only assume that that was me forgetting that I had seen an actual, like, beetle boar before. So, I mean, it, it was probably cut out, so it's fine. But, I mean, I got a hat out of the beetle, and then the bird dropped this thing? Whatever it is? I know what it is, but you don't know what it is, and I was confused about what it was, too. But we basically got a, um, a minigame out of Beetle Lad. And you can see we are very close to the end here, so I that's, this is why I just didn't want to try to hunt that bird again, because I feel like I got lucky that I was able to kill him in time. But, uh, the, the weird, like, globe is interesting to me. The, uh, the hat obviously is a minigame. We also got a stick. Very good. Really need that stick. So then I, I just want to see exactly what these things are. We got Dusty Crystal, I think, was on there. Yeah, Dusty Crystal and Kenpon Cap. So I, I wanted to make sure that this was a hat, and it is. Look at that. I also really want it to wait and see the guy get resurrect it but they really take their time i think you have to actually go into the menu before they decide to start digging and tossing hats in but we, i want i want to see this guy pop out look at him holding two like spoons and then i want it to read the uh the globe, although I went past it because I was confused. Dusty Crystal, obtained from Mamati at the Heave Ho Oasis. It reveals hiddens. I went too fast. It reveals hiddens. And I, I just really wanted to see this guy go, I guess. I like watching him walk. Hate to see them go, but love to watch them go off screen. 
and then the reveal hit. So with the uh, pre-recorded thing out of the way, I want to see what this mini game is like. Ooh, looks like I also have another mini game that maybe I missed. Like a little beanstalk. Also, going back and forth is a little disorienting. Clink, clink, clack. Greetings, Almighty Kami. I don't. I think I do remember this one. I'm Konkik Pawn, the crystal percussionist. Here with my spoons. Thanks to you, oh great one. Great Kami, Konkik Pawn, at your service. Great Kami, how about ore? Yes, I can do a nice number on it with my spoons. I do want ore. Cost medium meat, but I, I think that's fine. We can grind medium meat well enough. Wow. Rumble, Rumble, who are you? I don't like your bib, and I don't like your toes. Wow. I'm Rumble Thump, a newly born mountain. Wow. I'm a little baby. You're Konkapon, I'm glad you're here. Wow. Rumble, Rumble, I'm so big, nobody plays with me. Wow. Come on, come on, play, play, play with me. Wow. Rumble, rumble, ready to rock and roll. Tee hee. I get, I get it. I get it. You're a mountain. Memorize Rumble Thump's song and help Konkapon repeat the rhythm with the circle button. Okay. Got it. Shake, rumble, wonderful. What a wonderful song. Nailing it. Nailing it. This baby loves the toes being played with. Was that it? Shake Rumble, wonderful, what a wonderful sound. I'm so happy I'm crying rocks, take these as gifts. Nailed, nice, nailed it, real good. Uh, I'm gonna admit, I did actually play the minigame before this. I, uh, I just wanted to... Uh, one, I wanted to, like, get materials, but then I realized in hindsight I needed to kind of show off. And also he does have different dialogue when you start. So, the learning process, I was a little confused. In particular, I thought the, like, pinky toe was, like, a pause, and I kind of screwed up the first time I played through, but that's how you do that. Um, I didn't think I would be able to, like, perfect this, so I was just going to try to play it off. I'm sorry, I'm a cheater, I'm terrible. But I do want to try to get this beanstalk, because I'm assuming that I missed it. So, I have two theories. Maybe not so much theories. There is that weird flower in Patapa, Patata Plain. I think from the times I've gone there, it blooms when you are in fever mode. Maybe if I stay in fever mode long enough, it will like bloom fully and give me a hat. Additionally, there might be something I have to do in Creatures of the Sand, since I basically got everything out of Sandy Paradise. So I want to do that. Also, obviously grinding for better soldiers will be better now because we have a way to get metal. And then I guess we'll come back to Guardian of Nell. What is that? What? What? What happened? Can I attack it? Okay, it... Is it because I had the rain out? I'm glad my uh, patapons feel like attacking it. Sometimes they usually don't. Come on, draw me a hat. No hat. Well, that makes me want to rain more.
So I tried to uh, make it rain at the start of the stage. Okay. Things changed immediately. I thought maybe more flowers would appear, but the snail appeared. Maybe if I kill the snail. I mean, I already killed the snail, but... Well, now's our chance, so... I really screwed that up. Well, I don't think the snail can escape. Unless if it goes away when the rain's gone. Snail's dead. Come on, give me something. Let's go. What is that, a helmet? I mean... Maybe it's a minigame helmet. Too early. Well, all I have to do is win now. This stage didn't really have anything interesting. We saw the cool flower. And then I, uh tried to stall out with the fens at the start of the stage to get the rain immediately, hoping that maybe more flowers would appear. Get out of the way, pig. My, my, uh, confusion at the helmet we got here is the fact that, like, the other ones are very fancy for the minigames. And this is just kind of like a really basic looking one. Like, it looks like one we would equip to a pad upon, not one that a minigame would give us. I guess we'll see when we get through this. I also came here because I had some uh, trouble with trying to get the flower to spawn in Padapa Plains. Obviously, just mainly because of my rhythm. I like the times I've gone through there when I've been in fever mode. It looked like it was starting to go up, but then when I lost fever mode, it went back down. That's kind of why my theory would be that it needs to be fever mode. But we also, I think, were able to just like get coins out of it, so it might be the same as the other flower we saw here. Zack Pond's cap. Yeah, so that should be the minigame captain, right? Yeah, because it's just going immediately. Um, what I wanted to do at the moment is make one of you as a unicorn, I think. Oh, he's like a little farmer guy. He's got his little pitchfork. It's like a straw hat. He's just a little farmer boy. This um is gonna make Spiky Boy, right? Yeah, Spiky Boy. So high crit chance on arrows might be good. Curious to see if we can activate the bean with him moving here, but most likely we are gonna have to wait. Guess I can play with the baby again. I don't- I'm wondering what the beanstalk will actually get me, though. It wouldn't be, like, weapons, right? Or, like, hats? He loves it.
kind of almost lost it there, but I'm, I'm doing it. I'm in the zone. In the zone. I'm really good at smacking baby toes with spoons. Give me something good. I'm so happy I'm crying rocks. Take these as gifts. Let's go. Well, good drops on those, huh? Oh, he's still on his way. He's still moving. Let's do another mini game. I can use more tree branches, especially since I use my logs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I kind of hate that you have to go through all of the dialogue. Let's bond bond it up. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There was like a moment there where I think I hit the button too early, but it was still in the time frame where it works, and all I got was a stick. Nice. But like he didn't actually get his dance off. Oh, hey, great. We were able to just kind of stall out until we could actually play with poor man. Well, hello there. I fancy this be our first meet in Mighty Kami. I'm the farmer Zach Pawn. I can work the land alrighty and owe my life to the one pad upon the mighty. Hello there, oh great Kami. I'm Fazak Pawn and I'm raring to go. Need some extra food? You gave me the seed. Next I do my farmer's deeds. Oh, you want a stick? I'll, I got sticks. I liked it when they ask for like basic materials. Alright, what's up with you? Oh, my skin is blemished. Ah. I'm Pop Bean, the most beautiful legume around. Legume. Legma. It's a legume, right? Leg legum. I, I know I know it's like the I don't I don't use beans. I don't I think it's a legume bean. I'm I'm wrong. I'm super wrong. Oh, Fazak Pawn, how are you? Would you be kind enough to help out? Oh. La la la, good luck, require attention. Hurry, get me water. Oh. The law, follow my rhythm, and sprinkle me some water to help heal my poor skin. La dee dee, make me shine, oh please, dearie, please. La dee dee, ready or not, here we go. Okay. I don't get it. So I, I think, thanks so much, this is for you, dearie. Popping flings vegetables into the air. Pay close attention to the time of the beat to catch him. I don't get it. I got nothing. So, okay, so I think I just had to keep tapping to the beat for the first part. And then I don't know the fling vegetable part. Legume? That's not how you should pronounce that. Legume? I don't think I've ever actually heard how that's pronounced. Also, like, that's a really easy part of the mini game because I was on my phone while trying to play that. Obviously, I missed a little bit, but it worked out. It's 
kind of weird. Also, I still don't know why I want this cabbage. So, like, what, what does the cabbage... Do I have a cabbage now? Eyeball cabbage. Every Patapon loves nice, fresh cabbage. Well, we saw in the, um... Let me try that one more time. We saw in the manual from the help screen thing that there is, like, a chef cook thing. Maybe that's what that's for. Oh, it's not like I'm gonna really use plain sticks. I can see why this game takes, like, 15 hours to beat if you're really just messing around with all these mini-games. I fucked it at the end. Thanks so much. This is for you, dearie. This part I'm still not sure about. Oh, I missed the... F what was that? Uh, what are they called? The, um... Mangrove. Not mangrove. The the thing that screams. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to get good at this. What, what is the thing, the, the, like, the, it's like from Harry Potter, but not like, it's not just from Harry Potter, it's just a general mythical creature. Mandrake? Is it the Mandrake? Like, I don't know what... I just started pressing the buttons before the music actually started. La la la, I feel refreshed, my skin is renewed. Okay, I'm not gonna do this great. Well, I got two of them. I got the Mandrake. Mandrakes are real, so that's not what it is. Screaming plant. Let's look that up. Wait, it is a mandrake. Wait, so wait, 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 wait. I was right, mandrake. Is there like a real mandrake? I'm confused. Maybe I wasn't reading. Maybe I was reading like the fake lore behind a mandrake. Wait, what did I look up then? I'm sorry. This is uh Mandrake real. Oh, it is a real plant. Okay, that's my confusion. With a mythical past. I, so what is it? Just that it kind of... Like, it has legs. I guess when you pull it up, it looks like it has legs. So, of course, it looks like a little man. Okay. That, that was a little distraction. I got confused because the first result when I looked it up was like, this is a Mediterranean plant. I'm like, oh, that's a real plant then. So then I'm like, let's look up Screaming Plant, and I get the same result, but for the for Harry Potter, and it confuses me. What it is, is it actually? Is it just a mandrake? Blood Carrot. These carrots sprout in mass after a brutal battle. Full of blood. What is that? Oh, it's Lep Sword. Did it? It didn't have that coloration, did it? I guess I should expect Lep Sword to be special. Because it's like... So, okay, my assumption would be then, if we get ingredients and we can cook, we could probably put them up here, and it'll, like, I don't know, stat boost us or something. That's what I would assume. Yeah, I guess it is special. I mean, being able to put enemies to sleep does seem special. 